Testing, testing. Hi, guys. This is another haul from the garage. Um, I didn't have a whole lot of time to uh to do anything this morning. I I didn't wake up until eleven. Valerie called me after the show. And, um, I had stayed up until two listing. And so, um, I still didn't get everything listed. I have, I have about, I'm going to say five pieces left out of that haul I showed yesterday. Um, I think there's, uh, I think there's probably 20, three things in there or something. Anyways, I was a little bit busy with some other stuff yesterday um, for part of the time. So I just wanted to come on here and uh, give you another quick haul because I did go out and get another bag out of the garage and I washed it and uh, I didn't prep it or nothing, but I did uh, throw away two pieces from yesterday um, that I showed in the hall. Um, the Speedos and those Capri pants with the um, the embroidery on them. The Hi Hank! The, uh, the embroidery was really pretty. Hi Ansley! How you doing girl? Um, the embroidery was really pretty but I, I just I, there was a spot in the crotch that looked really loose and I just didn't want to, I didn't want to mess with it. And I thought that, um, you know, it wasn't a good reason to keep it. So, um, I went ahead and trashed it. Hi Liz. Whoop, whoop. Uh, thank you, Hank. I am really trying to like get into the, you know, even if I don't, do one of these every day. I want to do one at least, you know, like three times a week or something, you know, when I'm off or, or whatever and have time, time to actually list stuff. I want to, I want to be able to do it. Um, and so, yeah, I'm good. I'm good. Um, and, and so I, I went out Oh, I was telling you I, the speedos speedos looked a little fuzzy on the on the butt part. You know, even though the rest of them looked really shiny and new, it looked a little fuzzy on the butt part, so that's why I tossed those. And I could have probably got like 15 or 20 bucks for those, but I didn't want to mess with it. Hey, Deb, I almost forgot your name cuz I haven't talked to you in so long. <laughs> I'm like, hi. <laughs> Um, okay. So anyways, this is pro this was two loads of laundry. So, um, out of this one bag. So I'm just going to show that to you real quick. And then, um, I got to get to listing cause I have to work tonight. So I'm only going to be listing for probably two or three hours. So I figure, you know, even though, even though I, you know, if I prep it, you know, with washing it and stuff and then, you know, putting it in my little basket that I'm keeping stuff in that I'm listing for that day. You know, I figured that that will help me along to, you know, give me more motivation to have, you know, have stuff to list. All right. I'm getting to it, Hank. I'm getting to it. Okay. So these are riders by Lee. Size 20 medium. medium. Uh, they're a dark, they're a dark capri. And the crotch looks good. They actually look freaking brand new. Um, I don't see any like distress or anything in them. So those look good. Hot bum crack. About time you showed up, buddy. 
This is apple seeds. I don't think I've ever heard of that. Apple seeds. It's just a brown long sleeve uh long sleeve shirt. Yeah, as long as the crotch looks, looks good and free of rot. I agree. One, four, six, eight, five is the or a number it looks like. I don't know. Never heard of that. Apple seeds. I'll have to ask Valerie about that one. Or look it up. Whatever. Um this looks like a little I don't know what the hell this is. What is this? It's glow. Glow jeans. Glow. And do you see this? Like it looks like it would be a romper or something. But it's oh I see. It's a little dress. It's a little dress, but the sides are the sides are cinched. So I, I don't know how anybody could make that work, but uh, I'm gonna try it. The sides are cinched, huh? Glow is Glow is a Blair brand or sub brand. Glow Glow jeans and it's a small of course. Okay, so I mean it kind of looks a little retro. Do you see that? So we'll see. We'll see about that. Look it up and see what it's worth. Then, oh, apple seeds. Uh, this is called the limited. And let me figure it out here real quick. Um, what is going on here? It almost looks like a pair of panties and then with the skirt. So I figured it was like a. Okay. Now I'm all freaking confused. <laughs> okay. This is. Okay. It's not a pair of panties. It's a shirt. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm so confused. I think it's a yeah, it's a shirt. This is called the limited. And okay, so it looks like it buttons on that side. Oh, it's missing a it's missing a, a thingy. Oh, Glow is by J-Lo. Okay. So it's missing a thingy. So. That's the limited. Hello. The limited. I'm going to look this one up real quick. Because. I don't think it's going to be worth it to keep it and try and put another thingy on it. Um, uh, it looks like about 10, 10 something. I mean, some people don't mind putting another, what the hell? Some people don't need mind putting another thingy on them, but... 
another hook. It's missing the hook. The limited. Uh, shoot. Some of them look kind of good. Okay. I'm not, I'm not, I'm going to throw it away. Okay. Bye. That was kind of easy. <laughs> yeah, that hook, I, I, I could have probably replaced it, but who's got time for that? You know what I mean? Like, I, I don't have time to really do that. Why should I even say it? <laughs> this is cute. That's the back. Okay. And then that's the front. It's Route 66. But it's, I think it's cute junior piece. Cinched waist. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's why I was looking at it. But like, you know, some of the pieces are looking like 2025, you know. Um, so it's just like, it's better off to just say bye and, you know, be like, whatever. I, I got other stuff I can list that's not gonna, you know, be like weird. Um, this is, I don't know why I'm looking this up already. This is Lorraine. This is a vintage nightgown. I don't see any stains on it. And it's got that, it's super soft, uh, lace, uh, satiny fill. It's got that lace. Um, let's see, let's see if it has. <laughs> Thought it was a jumpsuit. And we're like, oh, where'd the pants go? Here we go. I don't know if this is. It's probably just like polyester or something. Um, but it's it's one of those oldie nightgowns, you know, oldie but goodies. You know, they're super comfortable. Um, and I, it seems like every one that I sell or every one that I put up, I sell on those. Um, <laughs> this is a... Sorry, my dogs are barking. Um, Falls Creek 4X. It's a green and it has um, some glitter work. Um, but I'll be able to sell that. Just the size. This is... This is cute. Um, this is a Catherine's 2X. And it's gray. And it's got that. I think it's... I don't know if you would call that applique or not. Um, it's like a... It's like a piece of material over the other material, the regular material. I think that's an app cave, but I'm not sure. But um, really cute. I actually looked this over last night because I was thinking about keeping it for myself. <laughs> but I got enough clothes right now. Um, so I'll be able to sell that, no problem. <laughs> yeah, the symphony of fuzzies is right. Okay, this is a yellow t-shirt by Hanes, large, and it's got pink butterflies on it. What do you think? Do you think I should try it? No stains. It's just a regular pink t-shirt with or a yellow t-shirt with 
<laughs> you're covering your eyes with the womeny things. <laughs> but um yeah, it's it feels like it feels like some of this is like print and some is that um the what do you call it? The um iron-ons almost but I mean it looks cute I don't see I don't see wear it or donate okay um probably just donate them I mean Haynes I, I know Haynes probably wouldn't <laughs> you think it's ugly <laughs> You don't like the pink things, though. Okay, what brand is this? Barely there. It's a C36. C36. And it's a push-up bra. Yeah, that's what I do, too, Hank. Um, yeah, I'll never wear these, um, even though it's a C cup and, but, um, I mean, looks, looks good. Doesn't have a whole lot of, of like fuzz or anything inside on the, on the thing. Um, but I think I'll try it. I'll have to look it up and see if, you know, if it sells for between 10 and 15, I'll be good. But the straps look good and all that. So, um, this is Kathy Daniels, and it's. I'm trying to think of what that material is called. It's kind of like, um, kind of like bubbly. You know, like the texture is different on it um it's 60 percent cotton and 40 percent polyester extra large um it's a button-up shirt and it looks like all the buttons are there so i think it's good to go i think i will keep that and try to sell it i'm not sure about the brand so i'll have to look that up seersucker that's what it is thank you hank And and some people some people like that stuff. Some people like that. I I don't think I would like to wear it. It's just I think it's too too much going on. Hi Valerie, how you doing today? Hi Jennifer. Sarah Sucker. I gotta remember that. This is Rebecca Malone, a uh, large. And it's, it basically looks like a regular tee. I don't know what's going on with that inside piece there. But, um, but then it has these, these, uh, I don't know, rocks or beads or whatever that's sewn on into the fabric the sequins yeah I, I, I will definitely listen now I don't I don't play that game with the the um you know, listing later or whatever. Yeah, and it's uh, it's kind of like ombre a little bit. It's darker here and lighter up here. So, I think I can sell that. Chevron embellishments. 
Good, I'm glad you're doing good. Um, this is a triple D Bali bra. And okay, I think I got it inside out here. Okay. I gotta check those those wires. Make sure those wires are all good. I hate that whenever those things come through. That that was trash. Wire was coming through on it. <laughs> well, crack, you're gonna have to cover your eyes a lot during this one, I think. This one is um, Duo Maternity, and it's a small. And it's just like a little um, tank top, and it has a zipper on the side. So, like, if your belly gets too big, you can, uh, and it's lined also. It's lined with another piece of fabric, so it just, I think it just needs to be probably uh what do you call it not press but the other um so i think it's cute cute colors so we'll see what we can do with that <laughs> thanks thanks hank i I am trying to um, to just kind of get through it. You know, like the quicker I do it, the better. Because if I sit there and and uh, talk about it, it's going to be harder. This is Liz and Me. It's a 24 or a, it's a 2X, 22, 24. And it's a denim shirt. And it does have some some designs on the front neckline uh, um really cute i don't think it has any stains from what from what i'm seeing no stains no wear or anything so i just need to get that that color it seems like the front or the inside has come up or whatever so I just need to fix that that won't take nothing steaming it so yeah I'll be able to sell that and then let's see um I don't think that was embroidered it was, uh, no, actually, I think it's like applique. It's like, it's like glued or something. Oh, maybe it is embroidered. Or just stitched. I don't. I think maybe it's just stitched in there. I don't know. Another piece fell on me. It it looks like it looks like it's very uh what do you call it? Like um like a regularly like swirly piece and stuff on and it looks like it's just stitched through it doesn't look like it's uh like it's embroidered all the way you know i don't know how to explain it like in if you look on the inside it kind of looks a mess it's not um stitched usually like how 
how things are embroidered, if that makes any sense. These are no boundaries, size 13. Crotch looks good. It does have, have some uh, distress on the front. But, like, there, it's not all the way through. It's just, like, you know, it's lighter color. And then it does have um, embroidery around the back with some, some little jewels. Looks like some of the jewels fell off. So what do we do? What do we do? We throw it on the pile. <laughs> and this, I can already see that this has a hole in the butt. This is Liz and Company, size 10. It's got a hole. Dang it. Dang it, dang it, dang it. Well, before I throw it in the trash, I gotta check the pockets. Okay. Goodbye, pants. You're going in the trash. I lost you for nothing. <laughs> Later, butthole. <laughs> this is Liz Claiborne extra large. It's just a long sleeveless, or not sleeveless, long sleeve. <laughs> yes, I just washed this stuff. And I did like, I did like kind of go through it, but I was kind of in a hurry yesterday. So. I didn't go through it that, that well, obviously, or we wouldn't be throwing things away today. It kind of has like around the, the V neck, it kind of has like a mesh. I think that's kind of cute. I think that's a little, a good little piece to list for one or two. It's a really cute color. I don't see any stains on it. That's <laughs> yeah, long sleeveless. <laughs> there you go, I was supposed to fix. Catch that one. <laughs> Yeah, it's, it's really cute. Um, this is St. John's Bay. And it's a extra, extra large. And buttons are good. Now, I know from experience that because I was looking for, for just some regular polo shirts. And I know from experience that there's a lot of people on eBay that sell just regular polo shirts, but they want to sell like a whole bunch together. Or if they're selling one, they want like a million dollars for it. So I know that if somebody's looking for a, a certain color, a polo shirt, it's kind of hard to find one. Um, I don't see, I don't see any stains on that one. Looks good. So I think I'll put that up. I know that the brand and stuff isn't all that, but it's whatever, you know. 
some people will buy it. This is Faded Glory, but I thought it was really cute. It's a large 1214, but it's a sheer polyester piece, um, and it's called Black Paisley. And I think somebody would want that. It's really pretty, but it's it's uh, completely sheer. So, can you see my face? <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I think I could sell that. I looked that over pretty good last night because I didn't dry it. I just um, I don't know what that was about. I just uh, air dried that, hung it up. Ooh, we got thirteen people in here. How fancy! This is kind of cute. It's American Eagle Outfitters. It's got that low V-neck. Yeah, some people really like wearing paste. I, I don't. I don't think it looks good on me. But some people really like it, and I think some people look good in it. <coughs> but um, I think I could sell that. And it's got the, you know, kind of, uh, um, what would you call that? A quarter sleeve. I thought that was a hole and it was a piece of white lip. <laughs> but yeah, it's cute. Almost done. <laughs> yeah, this does not have a tag. I hate that. I hate when they cut out the dang tags. Well, it says it's an extra large, but it's probably nothing. Um... It's probably nothing. Dang it. Um, see, I think, I think it's cute. I do think it's cute. But without the tag, it's kind of worthless to me. Because it's like, ugh. see, that's that's what this kind of stuff that gets me. It's like, I think I can sell it, but without that tag, you know, people like stuff with the tags. Wow, child. Um, don't see any. Oh, yes, they're stains. Dang it. It's an OP. God, I wish that was bigger. I would keep it for me. But there's no sense in messing with it if it's just going to give you grief, you know. This is Ann Taylor Large. Just a cute cute tunic top. Kind of feels like a, a really soft t-shirt material. I was thinking maybe it was cinched on the sides, but it's not. <laughs> yep, <laughs> I see the ache. <laughs> yeah, but this is, uh, I don't see any stains or anything on it. It just needs to be steamed. 
Um, let me look. It's it, it feels really good. I I like the way that Ann Taylor um, clothes fill most of the time. This doesn't have. It has a tag that says one. And it's, oh, there it is. It's rayon and spandex. It feels pretty good, though. If it, like, it feels good enough to wear. Um, yeah, better than those butthole jeans anyways. It feels good enough to wear if uh, it was it was another couple size larger, larger, I would keep it. So um, I really like I really like that soft fabric. I thought this was kind of cute. Yep. Better than those butthole jeans. And, and this isn't even the beginning of, I have to tell you that, like, I don't know how many bags I have in there that are those space bags, but I think I have at least 20. <laughs> <laughs> I think, I think I have at least 20. All right. This is J crew. This is a large, um, I think these are supposed to be a little messy. They're like flowers. That one probably can get the the extra um, string cut off there. But they're supposed to be like flowers. That's J. Crew. Oh, I am rolling in the clothes. This is for sure. And and I don't even really know like what's out there. That's that's the thing. That's why I'm like going through with you guys because I don't really know. So I thought that was cute. It's kind of like a peach color and then it's got that um I don't even know what you would call it. It's kind of orangey. That orangey color on top of it. With the flowers. Huh. Somebody I think will buy it. Thanks, Ainsley. This is Faded Glory uh, Woman's Plus Stretch. This is a 16W. And it's just a, a pretty, like, um, career blouse stretchy fabric um pearl snap get rid of that get rid of that strings and that strings um I know I got all kinds of surprises out there. But yeah, pro snap, stretch, plus size. And it's it's kind of real pretty. Um, kind of real pretty fabric. I would probably keep this for myself if, if it was my size. Well, let me show you up front. Like it's got that. Um, I don't know if it's a, a glitter uh, stitch. But it's more like. It's just kind of like shiny. The, um, the embroidered. Because it's like embroidered. All the way down. So it's, it's kind of real pretty. And then it's got that. Those buttons. So I can get some money for that. Even though it's made of glory, I'll show y'all. 
Um, maybe a metallic. Yeah, maybe that's what I was thinking. <laughs> Let's go on an adventure. Ooh um, this is Fashion Bug Extra Large. And even though, like, I know that, um, I think Lane Bryant bought Fashion Bug, if I'm not mistaken. I know that we lost our Fashion Bug here because we have a Lane Bryant in West Branch and people were, were going over there and getting better stuff, I guess. Um, this is a pink button up vest like shirt. Um, and even though, I don't know, it seems like vests are kind of hard to, to sell nowadays. I don't know. Maybe I got my prices too high. I have to go look at those, but um, you would think that people would like to wear this. I would wear this if I had, if I had it in my size. I don't know. I, I was thinking about that. And maybe if I, I know that I have like bras and slips and stuff like that so maybe maybe like that kind of stuff um i'll try to do that way yeah save on size and listings yeah i just don't i mean and it would be i i have like some of my stuff up on auction right now just to try and like move shit out because i have so much clothing yeah, definitely, Ansley. So let me show you this one real quick. I think I could sell this, uh, especially summer wear, you know, but it's summer somewhere everywhere. Some, summer somewhere everywhere. That's exactly what I said. I said, I was meaning to say it's somewhere, it's summer somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> 20 ish bags is a lot of clothing i think <laughs> yeah it is i was what i could fit into a large flat rate box, board game box but with poshmark you could do up to five pounds and really move it out true Yeah, that I don't I I don't know if I'm I'm ready to delve into that yet. But this is it. Just hot pink. Kind of looks kind of almost looks something in that one. In that camera. Anyways. Looks hot pink here. Um but I think I could I think I could uh, sell that. To the right person who's ready to buy. Woo! I sold a hat yesterday. I didn't sell shit today yet. But that's how it is, right? Keep on plugging on. I thank you guys for joining me. And uh, I'll see you tomorrow on the show. I slept through it this morning. I'll obviously um so i will see you later thank you for joining me get it get it liz i'll see you guys later love you bye have a great rest of your day